So you're probably familiar if you edit in Premiere Pro that since one of the recent updates, there are so many with iPhone that um, the video is defaulting to a color profile that isn't necessarily read well by the default in some video editing software. And for that reason, when you're scrolling Instagram or, you know, wherever, you're gonna see like an unusually bright video. Um, and if you pull it into a video editing software, typically it's very overexposed. So I'm gonna show you how to fix it. There, I've tried a ton of ways to fix this and some are eh as far as being effective where like you'll set all of your color exposure, shadows, highlights, all the things, and then you export it and it's just like the color's a little bit dull. I know, I've been there. Um, but I'm gonna show you how to fix that before doing anything. You just pull in your footage, fix it, you're done, you're good. So um, this is like a screen recording that I'm gonna be editing. You can see this, this is fine. Um, but this one is clearly overexposed. So, in order to fix this, before I even get started editing, I'm just going to right click it. I'm going to say Reveal in Project. That's going to show me the exact um, track. And if you have a ton of stuff loaded up already, that's going to help a lot to reveal it, especially if you're bad at naming things like I am. Uh, once you find that in the track, it, it, or excuse me, in the project, you can right click it. You're going to go to Modify, and then you're going to go to Interpret Footage. Once that is open, you're going to go to the bottom. You see color management. You're going to select color space override and um, whatever this is on, <laughs> you're going to change it to REC 2020. And I'm going to show you the difference. So I haven't applied it yet. It's on the 2100 still. So R REC 2020, okay, boom, done. It, re it resorts back to what it would have been based off of just original footage and then I can edit as normal and export as normal and it will come out normal. You can thank me later. I hope this was helpful. <laughs>